Hello there, Gemini. Welcome to your second half of August 2023 love reading. Now, when I was shuffling them, the death card jumped out. So you might be all of a sudden going through an ending or a rebirth or a transformation. Let's see if it comes out again. Okay, I'm going to take them now since they're popping. Oh, the Knight of Swords. So this could be your energy or it could be a air, another air sign. It could be a Gemini, Aquarius, Libra. You could either be going someplace quickly here or wanting to go someplace quickly. Someone could be coming towards you. We have a cat. Independent, balanced, psychic. Let's see, Knight of Swords. What else we get for you? Oh, where did this card come from? This is a whole different deck. Wow. Okay. Huh. Four of Pentacles. Let's see what this card is. Eight of Wands. Something might be moving quickly towards you. I gotta put that back in the right deck. But that might be a reason for it. I, you know, it's really weird because I did Aquarius a reading. I didn't even see the card. That is strange. Okay. So four of pentacles. Holding on. Holding back. Holding tight. Hmm. Okay. Let's see what else we get. The lovers. Okay. So. Oh, this one wanted to come out. Okay. The lovers and the king of pentacles. Gemini energy. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. And the chariot. Interesting. And we have the full new beginning. I think someone wants to communicate with you. I'm going to take the eight of wands as meaning something here. It's got to stand out. There's got to be something going on quickly here. Because between the eight of wands moves fast and the chariot. King of Pentacles. Someone very financially secure. Stable. This could be someone coming towards you or this could be your energy. Let's see. We have a shell. Now, when I see the shell, a lot of times I think of clam up. Or, yeah, that's the only thing I'm getting from this one. Clam up. Someone's clamming. Some, this person does not talk. This person's very quiet. I don't think that's your energy then. I think it's somebody else. The fool, new beginning, taking a leap of faith. Some might want to come quickly towards you. But I'm putting these two together. This person doesn't speak. They have a lot of emotions, a lot of feelings, but they sort of stay quiet. They observe. They're very observant. They like to watch people. They're a people watcher. Okay, let's see. Why do we have the Knight of Swords here? Ah, Ace of Wands. A lot of passion, desire. Someone's coming towards you. A lot of passion, and desire. But why is the Four of Pentacles here? Judgment. Making a judgment call, coming towards you. Maybe you have to decide on what you want here. Because this person, you might have... See, I keep on getting to that. Clam up, clam up. Okay, the lovers. This person does not like to express themselves. Seven of Wands. I feel like this person felt on top of the world when they were with you. And you stand out. You, you have this shine. You have this light. And they're very attracted to it. Now, what about this King of Pentacles? Ah, Ace of Cups. They have a lot of love for you. But they didn't tell you. They didn't open up. But now they want to come in quickly. Okay. The Chariot. Why is the Chariot here? Cancer Energy. Hmm. Look at that. Again. The Knight of Swords. So expect this person to come flying in. <laughs> Very quickly. Okay. We have here the Unicorn. Because you're one of kind. You're unique. You're different. And they can't find that in anybody else. Eight of swords. They're stuck in their head. And this person, maybe because they're quiet. I think other people t think they could tell them what to do. And it confuses them. And I think they're, almost feels like they're coming to a realization. That these other people don't know what the hell they're talking about. But I feel like they get stuck in the head because they have these other people trying to tell them stuff. They really should not listen to them. But I think they're finally waking up. Okay. Oh, I feel like I'm going to sneeze. Ooh. Let's see what else we get for you. Page of Cups. Let's go 
Scorpio Cancer Pisces energy. Someone's thinking it'll bring you a gift. Look, Six of Cups. Yeah, someone from the past. A transition, a change. Um, oh, this person. Wow. This person heads to, out towards you and turns around. And they'll do it. I don't know how many times he did that. They, they decide not to. Not now. I'll do it again. I'll do it tomorrow. I'll try this again tomorrow. Mm. Because they know they have to open up and they're not used to it. Yeah, four of swords. Their person is stressing out over this. There's something happened in between between you guys. Might have been a third party um, situation here. They know they wrecked this situation. They're trying to decide what to do, but they don't know. They're afraid if they come towards you with an offer, you're going to refuse them. You're in your own zone. Hangman, they're trying to gain a different perspective. I don't know. They feel like they've been waiting too long, though. I think they might feel like, okay, now I waited so long, I don't know if I can even do this. Because what is Gemini going to think? What, did they get, what are they going to say here? The hangman. Pisces energy. Hmm. Okay, let's see. All right, why do we have the Page of Cups here? The Empress. See, they see you as an Empress. You're abundant. You're very good looking. You're intimidating. <laughs> and it's also like you're very creative. Very inspiring. Okay, so this. I don't know. It's like Six of Cups come back in the past. See, they're, they're, they hid their emotions. They did not speak. They hide, they hide things. They don't like to. They don't like to show their vulnerability. They don't like to sh express themselves. Pisces energy. Four of Swords. They want to heal this situation. They want a new start full. Yeah, they definitely want a new start with you. Two of Swords. Not sure how to go about this. See, they might be the Emperor wanting to come in towards you. But they're not sure of the next move. They're not sure how to actually... They want to make sure they, they do this very strategically. They have to do this in a very certain way. This person thinks too much, I think. They think you overthink things. What about four cups? Let's see here. Okay, we got the eight of wands. See? Came back up. It's sort of like almost telling me like this is like the clarification that was gonna that something's gonna happen fast with this person. I think they're just gonna go for it. I think that was sort of like what the other what Aquarius energy too the reading was. Oh, nine cups, because you are the wish fulfillment. They're gonna wait on it a while and they're gonna, you know, dwell on it. They're gonna dwell on it and then finally they say, heck with it. I gotta move on this. Okay, let's see what else we get for you. Okay, the two of wands. See now, you guys are a good match too, you know? It's like Emperor and Empress, power couple, two of wands. I think they realize that, but they're just afraid. See, yeah, stuck in their head. Not sure how to do this. Eight of swords. They feel trapped. They're making their own trap here though. King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Well, yeah, look, this might be something to do with a mother and son. Or, well, I don't know why I said son. Mother and child, but son came out. So it might be a mother and son. It could be their mother. I mean, this could also be a mother and daughter. This could be their mother and that you could be dealing and you could be the whatever it doesn't matter it's it's they might someone might be dealing with their mother's influence king of wands um aries leo sagittarius you gotta take charge take take control of the situation um five of cups you know they keep on kicking ideas around but they're not they can't seem to focus on something. They don't focus well. Queen of Wands. Look at that. We have the King and Queen of Wands. You guys are very attracted to each other. 
I mean, you could reverse them. Um, think oh, I put the wrong one here. This King of Pentacles. This um, you could, you know, yeah. This could be reversed. I'm taking you as Queen of Wands, but it could also be reversed. There's a very strong chemistry here, but this person's lack of action, lack of motivation doesn't really and it's really weird because they're if they're king of wands they should be very motivated very active but they're more like it almost feels like this person does have the energy of a king of pentacles king of wands so they have a lot of passion and desire but as far as the, they're moving it's more like it's slower it's not they just don't move <laughs> it's like Let's see. We have here Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, they have to put the work in. They realize they have to put the work in and get their wish fulfillment here. Okay, what about this Two of Wands? This is a heavy burden trying to decide how to do this. And this person wants to leave these burdens behind so they could come towards you. What about the Eight of Swords? High Priestess. Might be secrets. See, this person might help back a big secret, maybe. High Priestess. And this is what's stressing them out. They didn't tell you something. And they don't know how to tell you now. And I think if they come towards you now, it's like they're going to have to reveal something here. And they're not sure how to do that. Okay, what about this King of Wands? King of Swords. They have to come in and speak their truth. They're trying to tap into their King of Swords energy here. Okay, we've got two here. We have a soul machine and a key. Oh, yeah. See, they know the key is that they have to fix this. They have to manage This is their responsibility to fix this. It's not yours. It's theirs. They know it. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. They have to also put the pieces together for you because there's something that's confusing to you. And you're not understanding why something happened or why why they couldn't do something or it's gonna be different for everyone I, I but there's something that wasn't done wasn't completed or there's something you don't know because they're hiding it okay and they're really upset about this they know they upset you the five is changes to the five of cups yeah page of swords they might be watching you they might be trying to see what you're up to. If you're with someone, what's going on there. And they're also, um, I don't know, I feel like they're watching you um, do something new. It feels like you started a new business or you started a new adventure here. You started something here. And you're sort of like, like involved in that, learning something new. You might be taking classes or you might be, you know, studying something new. But they're watching. They're aware of something here. Yeah, look, two hearts here. Open hearts. This person wants to be with you. And the Queen of Wands. <laughs> Hangman again. And the Wheel of... Okay, this person almost feels like, okay, I'm going to just let things happen if they happen almost. I don't like that. It's like, they're so... They don't move. It's, you're not going to... This energy is not going to jive with yours then. Because you're going to be doing things. You're going to be moving. You're going to be doing what you have to do here. You're an air sign. You're not going to be just sitting around. So I don't know if this is going to pan out for you or not. You guys, if you come together, could be a very strong power couple here. It almost it seems like someone's got a lie of fire under their butt or something. I don't know. Okay, let's see what we have here. What's going on with the Knight of Swords? So it's weird because they start out coming towards you real quick. They still might come towards you. But when I'm getting in, in the end, it feels like this energy that I'm feeling right now for this person is like, okay, I'm going to just sit back and think about this again. <laughs> they like to just sit and think. Okay, we have here. Hey, look, message. So eventually I think they'll, they'll move to you. But they go back and forth. Messes, honest, love, confess. Yeah, they want to confess their love to you. They definitely want to do that. Just afraid to. They don't know how to. What about this King of Pentacles? 
memories single intruder okay someone might intrude on this connection that's what holds them back because maybe they didn't stand up to someone i feel like maybe someone stepped right in and they didn't do anything because they thought well maybe you might like this person more it's like sometimes this person doesn't feel like they have enough self-confidence okay what about this knight of swords and then they get these spurts of energy where they want to come flying in player regret is it okay so you might have been dealing with a player that regrets playing and now they might come in and ask you a question is it or maybe you'll ask them is it what about this page of cups realize committed closure Ooh. okay they realize it's their fault because you wanted to be in a commitment and and they weren't moving so it ended up being closure it's like that was it you know we weren't gonna wait forever what about this king of wands I don't get two on this one feelings contact okay this person wants to contact you because they have a lot of feelings for you then we have the king of swords love eventually caring mm -mm. i don't know what to make out of that but this person does care for you and they have love for you I almost feel like eventually they are, they're going to contact. I'm going to put those two together. Okay, what about Page of Swords? They're just back and forth, back and forth. And we have Breakup, Marry, Friends. Okay. Now, did were you married to this person and maybe some friend or friends came in between you guys and broke this up for some of you? Or did someone actually break up with someone to marry a friend? Someone that they've been friends with forever. And then it's like on the rebound, they just married someone. Ooh, that's tough. That is a bad choice. Okay, what about a Queen of Wands? I mean, it almost feels like you're doing something, but you're not putting any real thought into it or not following your heart. Pleasure, finances, gift. Okay, let me clarify the finances. So they might come to you with a gift. Let's see. They might write a check. <laughs> okay. Okay, they might write you a check for something made to buy your own gift. It almost feels like this person, money is probably important to them. So they fear that's that's their way to express themselves by giving you a gift of money to do what you want. Because maybe they're not very good at picking out gifts. I don't know this energy is really weird because it feels like there's a strong attraction. There's a strong chemistry here. But I don't think you guys are on the same wavelength though. Okay, let's see what signs we have. What are the signs here? Cancer. Capricorn. Virgo. Gemini. Scorpio and Leo. Okay, so this could be placement, your chart placement, other people's charts past present and future we have cancer capricorn virgo gemini scorpio and leo now let's do the letters we're gonna do 11 letters for initials first name last name if you get both someone's initials for the first and last name and they have a middle name and you know that middle name you get that initial also all the better past present and future also your own initials we have i r w l oh and the l just flipped to o you know i'm gonna leave on the o but take a l too n Got one that way. <laughs> I G D R Z Y. Okay, so the letters we have for today are I R W O N and the L I G D R Z Y. Now let's do the names. Let's get 11. Whoa, that one went flying out. Who is it? It's Jamar. Jamar. J-A-M-I-E-R. That one wanted to jump. Oh, and so did Stella. They both jumped out together. Okay. And then we have Ashish. I'm not sure how to pronounce that. A-S-H-I-S. -S. And we have Paul Luinel. L-O-U-I-N-E-L. 
we have Freddie, Cindy, C-I-N-D-I-E, Kim, Cerdy, C-E-R-D-Y, and Richelle, R-I-C-H-E-L-L-E. -L -L -E. I need one more. And we have here Sharif, S-H-A-R-I-F. Okay, so those are names. Now remember, guys, these are general readings. They are not personal readings. Please just take what resonates, leave what doesn't. If it does not resonate with you, check out your other placements, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Something might resonate with you more in one of your other placements. Or it might be that missing link, the missing piece of the puzzle that clicks everything together. Also, at the end of each one of these readings, you'll see a little thumbnail comes up. If you click on that, it'll bring you to the previous reading. Now, the previous reading I did for you guys was the second half of um, August 2023 general reasons these are love readings so um if you want to check that out just click on the link and click on the picture i'll take you right to that link there all right guys i love you so much i appreciate all your likes your shares your subscribes your comments and i hope to see you all again real soon thank you